Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. And welcome back to The Division 2. This is Hill here with another episode. And in our last episode, we rescued the citizens back here in this encampment from the outcast. But we were trying to get to the Dark Zone West, I think it's called. And uh, that side mission just popped up and lured us in. So, I mean... Who can resist? Water detected. Oh no, drinking water too? Hostile control point identified. Who can resist saving civilians? All right, I don't see any drinking water. And I'm not here for drinking water. I'm trying to get to Dark Zone East or West. East, West. Oh my goodness. Oh no. I gotta go through all these people. You got to be kidding me. Can I throw that far? Oh, they would start walking. Uh, really? It's the damn outcast. Well, at least the true sons didn't respond. All right, so there's still somebody out here. Think. Okay. Wow. Took us both down. All right. We're headed back to Dark Zone West to do our recon. like to just get past this control point. All I want to do is get to Dark Zone East. Is this or West? I keep on calling it the wrong thing. Detecting high threat enemy patrol. I bet. So this is how it's going to be. Drinking water nearby. I think I'm going to have to get up on this bridge in order to get through here. Detected. Near my location. Guarded by hostiles. Of course it is. Oh, these are our people. Oh. 
Got him. We made it through. Take a breath. It's what we can do if we believe in ourselves. That's right, people. Believe in yourselves. Had nothing to do with me happening along and killing this guy for you. All right, let's continue. Dark Zone West. Oh the my God! Of had already constructed a wall around the community when the DC-62 started to kill them. Map DZ West and extract what you can. I've arranged a supply drop of C4 so you can breach the main gate. Oh, okay. I thought this was some other mission. <laughs> I thought I triggered yet another mission other than the one that I wanted to go on. Okay, so let's make sure there's nothing hidden back here. Looks good, looks good. Um, am I supposed to climb this? Yeah. Was isn't this where the supply drop should be? Isn't that how that works? Get a little flare. There we go. You know that thing could have killed me <laughs> if I was standing there. Alright, breach the gate. And it was this gate down here, okay. Right, placing explosive. That was loud. Hopefully, it didn't attract too much attention. Mm -hmm. You know it did. But I do like how they've made these dark zone. Uh, Recon missions different from one another. It's not all the same stuff. Initiating what? Looks like it might take a while. Oh great! So I'm under Last attack then. Of course. The explosion must have drawn their attention. Now that the main gate is gone, they'll try to take advantage of that. Somebody else ran over here. Thanks, whoever did that. So it looks like uh, Isaac got this turret going in. Override complete. All right. Move in and gather a map of the site. <clears throat> Area scan location identified. Incoming dark zone drop. You know, all these dark zone rooms look the same. They all got this giant worm looking thing in here. I know it's a, a hose or two, but it looks like a worm. Anyhow, let's go. Dog zone entered. Dog zone drop has been delivered. Okay. These turrets seem active. At least they're not shooting me. Um, wow. Who is this down here? 
You know, of course, they would make the last Dark Zone recon mission the, the hardest. All right, we need to go for the drop. Because those enemies were all yellows and golds, it looks like. Look at this. The dark zone drop is guarded. How close can I get? Portable device detected. I got everything. So fucking boring. Let's see if I can brighten things up, sir. Out of ammo. I just had ammo. At least he didn't try to rush me. That would have been a problem. All right, let's go ahead and deconstruct the Mender Seeker Mine. Okay, so what is this? The first thing you've got to understand is the rich are different. They want something, by God, they're going to get it no matter what. So, when word came down, they were looking for a test bed for DC-62. Some of the rich folks got it in their heads that they wanted it first. Which is why I'm here, in Georgetown, setting up the blowers so we can coat entire houses right fast. Alright, and I just noticed, of course, there's a timer on getting this uh, drop. Fortunately, we got here with four minutes to spare. Um, let's go ahead and open this. I guess there's no need to steal it. Uh oh. Oh! Oh! I forgot these things blow up too. Okay. Now we have a landmark to clear also. Oh, they're just throwing this all at us. And another drop available? You know, this does not make me feel warm and fuzzy about the dark zone, I'm going to tell you right now. So we can't get to the drop this way. 
Let's see if we can't get to the uh, landmark. But again, you know, as far as maps go, this looks like another fun map for uh, people with PvP interest and who enjoy killing other players. This looks like a very interesting map. I'm sorry, I'm not one of those people, though. I'm one, a casual player that loves playing PvE. Um, I really enjoy story and stuff, unfortunately. For Division 2, that was lacking a lot, the story. But there's plenty of gameplay, and I'm enjoying that. But as far as doing the PvP stuff, I will continue to skip it if I can. Okay, back here. They are really making you explore. Oh, what's this? Hack Shade Network. Can I do that? Seriously? Okay, you know, because I don't play in the in the dark zone, so I didn't know. Now I'm rogue. Thank goodness there are no players in here to hunt me down. So is this our landmark? Seems like it. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm, I'm as good as dead already. Look at this. Seriously? Well, at least I guess I can respawn. And this is somebody's idea of fun, really. This many enemies attacking me at once. Okay. You know I'm playing solo. Ubisoft. I mean, I think three enemies would have been enough. And especially, you know, if you're trying to gently introduce the Dark Zone to, to people that don't normally play it or didn't like the other one, in the first division, this is not the way. I was completely overwhelmed. The DCCC2 shipment just arrived. The container's being offloaded as we speak. You're kidding me. I've got to start all over again? Believe me, the majority backs me, and they feel confident that DC-62 will keep them safe. Except... <laughs> Correct. Initiate area scan. Rogue status removed. Okay, well that's a safe plus. Area detected. Entering safe area. Entering dog zone. All right, so we're gonna continue with our scanning. That's what we did in the other two zones. So I guess with me Updated. failing. Echo detected. Collect the supplies and head to the Echo location. Okay. So with me failing, it looks like the, um... Whatever you call that. The thing I was supposed to clear is gone. It's no longer uh, an option for me. Wow, look at this. Okay, we have an echo. Activating. People of Georgetown, building the wall was the right choice, the smart choice. But now we face a new set of challenges. We will never be truly safe until we can prevent the spread of green poison. DC-62 is our best option. But 
This is not up to me. He's right. DC-62 will save us. That's bullshit, and you know it. You're willing to risk the lives of everyone in Georgetown. DC-62? No one knows what that shit is or what it will do. Shay, your fear-mongering isn't fooling anyone. It's not fear-mongering if it's the truth. The truth. The truth is we need to evacuate the infected from Georgetown. If we let them stay, the disease will spread. There's a Sarah camp on the other side of the wall. They are better equipped to treat infected people like Shay. What? I'm not infected! Shay's already compromised our safety with her wild accusations. We can't let her compromise our health. Okay. So, did anybody even test this stuff? Doesn't seem like it. She didn't stand a chance. They were always going to use the DC-62. She ended up at the DZ South camp because she was banished from Georgetown. It wasn't because she was sick. It was because she was a problem. Contaminated gear okay. detected. All right, looks like it's this way. So was this um, some sort of an amphitheater, it looks like, where they would do performances and whatnot? Interesting. Okay, so at least we're getting back to the, the roots of the Dark Zone. They put contaminated gear in this recon mission. Now detecting contaminated gear. We'll need a right. complete map of DZ West. Perform another scan of the area. Area scan location identified. Location, is that B? Kind of looks like an eight, but I think it's probably a B. All right. Yeah, I could do without any more confrontations. It's like I would just like to map this uh, dark zone and go home. I guess it's not so bad if you're with other people that, uh, you know, might have your back. But when you're solo, you know, the, the anxiety is there. Map it's updated. real. Extraction point identified. Go to the extraction point and signal a helo for your contaminated gear. Okay. Aha, this way. So, do we have ropes that I can take up? Or, oh, this is a theater. Wow. I wonder if anybody, you know, would ever break into a place like this and just watch, uh, you know, whatever movies were out at that time. I mean, that's definitely something to take your mind off of this crap. Okay, here we go. A rope. Alright, call in the extraction. Does it matter where? Okay, first of all, well, I guess the thing doesn't have to land. So we'll just call it. Incoming. Hostiles detected. Of course they are. Shit. See, they didn't do that in the first one. Don't let them compromise the extraction. And they're coming from all sides, too. See the helo going the other way. Okay, are there more coming up behind me? Oh! This is way too hard. Now that just ain't. 
See, this is the kind of shit I'm talking how this game just has these people coming out of nowhere. There's nowhere safe. And I'm am I gonna lose my uh window? Yeah, I did. You know why? Because of everybody coming at me from all sides. Time to the map. Agents. Every time you think that it's safe behind you, then somebody just magically shows up. All right. Oh, now I can call in another extraction? You want... You know what? No thanks. I don't need this thing, whatever it is, anyway. But yeah, that's the thing I miss about Division, the first Division. It's like you could hunker down in most areas and, and fight and not have to worry about... Uh, People coming up behind you and the sides and all that. Inexcusable. Whatever happened to him, I hope he got what he deserved. Okay. Get to the nearby shade terminal and upload the map for DZ West to the network. All right, so hopefully, I think my contaminated gear has been destroyed. Let's go. Yeah, I just, I'm sorry. I just don't like the Dark Zone. There's nothing they can do to make this, uh... I mean, even without the players in it, I, I didn't enjoy it. Okay, where is this shade terminal? Back here. All right. The DZ West is now up on the Shade Network and available to all agents. Great work. Listen, I want to apologize. It was my job to help facilitate access to the DZs, but I also needed some answers to questions I've had for a while. Now that I have them, I think I just have more questions. Agent, thanks for all your help. Whatever. Oh, you're kidding me. So to get to these underground areas, I gotta... Uh-huh. All right, well. <laughs> All right, so that concludes... Awesome. Guarding location nearby. That concludes our recon of Dark Zone West. And this has been Hill, and I'm out.